because he can win. This is Luis, should be the model for today's shootings. Why am I in the room to start this video? Due to MCO, we can't really go outdoor with our first right? However, we can do the shootings at home. Today, we will demonstrate how to do the shootings in the room. To do pet photography shooting, you require a number of things. First, will, of course, will be the pets. Best if you can take some time to teach your dogs some simple commands like sit, wait, or come. Then you also need to prepare some things that you can make your dogs to look at the camera. For example, we have the toys. Then some toys will be like having some sounds for better attraction. Some of their favorite treats or some things that can make some sounds like. <laughs> different dogs might have different level of attraction to the items that you prepare. So best to find some things that uh, it likes, but not too active that uh, it will lead them to come to you. The third thing should be the lighting. This is our shooting environment. I choose the room with the windows on the side so that uh, the natural light will be coming in from the windows. You also see the white curtains that I use. So this will be act like a diffusers and also we block uh, some complex view from the outside. Number 4 will be the camera and the lenses. Today I'm using Sony A7 Mark III. A7 Mark III has the animal eye autofocus so I can shoot my pets easily. These are Sony camera with animal eye autofocus. Sony Real-Time Eye Autofocus is an advanced AI-based subject recognition technology. It enables fast, precise, automatic detections and tracking of the eyes of various animals. The lenses that I use today will be 35mm, 50mm and 85mm. Before we start, let's switch on Animal Eye Autofocus. Then, select Animal as Subject Detection. After we have set it up, we will see the grey box on Louis' eyes. I'll use high key in this shooting, so overall the picture will be brighter, less shadow. The aperture that I use will be wide open, f1.8 to 2.8, so that I just focus on the head or the eyes of Louis. I'll adjust the ISO accordingly to make sure that the shutter speed will be faster than 1 over 100 seconds. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. If you want to see more pet photos, you can check it out on our Facebook page and Instagram. Bye bye.